Hello friends. Today we see a new project about Teresa management system built by using HTML, CSS, JavaScript, PHP and MySQL. It was my database management mini project in fifth semester engineering. Here we use XAMPP as our local server so before starting the project make sure that you install XAMPP and check that it's working fine. You need to paste the code given in GitHub link to a docs folder in XAMPP folder. You can use any text editor to edit the code I will use Sublime Text Editor. So this is the code. It has many components for each of its parts. Let's run the project. To run this program in the local server you need to open XAMPP and click on Start Apache and MySQL. This will start the server and database. I will also give database file in my GitHub you just need to import it in my admin. To go to PHP my admin click on the admin button in front of MySQL. Once you start the server you need to open the Chrome and type localhost and search. It will open a docs folder in the XAMPP folder where you have pasted the code. Here you can see the folder you pasted click on that. Now you will see the web page. This is how the web page looks like. It has many features. It has a cool navigation bar at the top and a footer at the bottom. In the search bar you can search the destination name and you will get information about that place. At the top right corner you will get different options to browse. It has a good sign up page. You can enter your details and click on sign up. If you already have the account then click on already have account and you will see a sign in page. At the top right corner you will get different options to browse. Destination has all the destination name and details, where you can travel. It has smooth hover effect. There are many places where you can travel. If you click on visit you will get complete information about that place. If you click book tour you will get a booking page where you have to enter your details and book the tour. In the gallery you will get different picture of destination places. You will get many different view here. This is the sign up page which we have seen earlier. At the end you can see a feedback page where you can give your feedback to the developer about the web page. Note that all the information gets stored in the database. So if you are using XAMPP it is mandatory to create the database at the first. If you have any questions or errors please put it in the comments I will reply to all of you. You will also get GitHub link in the description. So this is it for today guys if you enjoyed the video then please like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.